Hola. Let's ride. Hey there, this is day four of my video diary as I'm cycling across Europe today. I spent the whole day in Ghent, which is literally in the middle of Belgium ish. Um, so, what did I get up to today? Um, this morning I went out for breakfast. I was down to look for a nice cafe, and most of the ones I sat found didn't really serve much food, more beer and wine actually. Uh, but I did manage to pick up a couple of little things that sparse, and that was alright. And then after that, I sort of checked out Ravenstein Castle, which was quite interesting really. Um, it's sort of gone through a lot over the years, originally it was a castle meant for sort of defence and offensives, um, then it became a court, then it became a glass mill, um, but yeah, as castle goes and as tours went, it was a pretty good one. And then after that I checked out St. Bath's Cathedral. Um, I've been to a lot of cathedrals. It's a lot of good iconography and there the statues and that. There's some painting there about Jesus and an adorable lamb. I'm not sure, I'm sure what that one was. So I had to pay extra to see it, so I didn't bother. Um, but it was nice. I enjoyed it. And then, I still do after that. Oh yes, and then I went for lunch and I found this uh, lovely baked potato place. Another Greek goddess baked potato with salad. It was quite a lot to do it. Quite a lot to it. It was really enjoyable. But there was one more thing about this potato place. So I'm in this toilet in a cafe and as you might expect in most toilets there's ladies and there's a gents. But when you go inside all you can see is the toilet for the gents. And the reason for that is because the urinal is out here. So if a lady wants to go to the toilet she might have to walk by a pissing man. And another thing about toilets. So this is a toilet in my hostel room. And unfortunately it didn't come with any toilet paper on this roll. But thankfully you don't have to worry about that. Because the hostel actually have two toilet roll holders there. So even though that one's ran out, we still have some here. But that one's almost half gone. So thankfully there's a third toilet roll holder. So even when the second toilet roll holder runs out and there's none left in the first one, we have some more toilet roll. We are covered for toilet paper on every possible angle. Then after lunch I went down to the southern part of Ghent and there's a couple of things down there. First of all I checked out the botanical gardens. Yeah, that's all it really was to the Botanical Gardens, but it was a nice place and good relaxing walk around. And then after that I checked out Smack. It's a modern art installation museum type thing. Um, there's a few exhibits on there. The first one I didn't really get. Here's, here's some of the information with the pictures. The second installation was about a woman taking photographs of her parents. Just a nice family album really. And then the third one was about a person who... Families, when they go on holiday, they like to let out their homes to the porn industry. And this one was taking photographs of normal people's homes with porn stars in them. I don't think I quite get modern art. But then after that, I sort of just had a bit of a relax, sort of just quite tired, had a nap, and then finally I went out for dinner, which was a bit there. Um, went to this restaurant called Twilight and had a spaghetti dish there, which was first of all massive, um, but that's the best thing I can say about it really, because it was just bland and oily. 
Um, you could see the oil in the sauce, and the sauce was really liquidy and runny. And it wasn't great, but you know, it fed me up, and I sort of need it because I've got uh, another cycle journey tomorrow. As tomorrow, I'll be cycling on to Stroberg or Stroberg or Stoberg. I'll have to look that up and make sure I know where I'm going. But if you want to see how I get on cycling tomorrow, join me then. Bye.